Hey everyone, welcome back to my YouTube channel. On today's video, I'm gonna teach you how to create a website banner using Canva. So if you want to learn how to create banners on your website to promote your Etsy products, or maybe your Etsy email list, or anything else that you wanna promote, make sure that you watch all the way to the end. I'm gonna show you step-by-step step how to do so. And if this is your first time visiting my YouTube channel and you want to learn how to build an impactful online business, don't forget to subscribe today. Give this girl some love by liking this video and leaving a comment below. So let's go ahead and dive in. Now I recommend using Canva because it's very simple to use um, compared to if you use Photoshop, it has a learning curve. Um, in the future, if you do plan to start creating your own graphic designs and and take it to the next level, I highly recommend learning Photoshop. But just keep in mind that it does have a learning curve. Um, Canva is pretty simple. Just, you know, you tweak it. You could make the, the, the sign, um, the design in the size that you want. And you could just drag and drop and it's very simple to put together. So it shouldn't take you long to do so. And what I'm talking about when I say a website banner, I'm going to show you my blog and I'm going to visit my, the section of the blog and my website. And these are banners. This is one here. This is more of a square banner. This one as well. This one is a little bit longer than the other one, a little bit bigger, but it's also square. This is another one that I did. This is one that I did that's a little bit longer, taller. Um, so these are all banners right here. All of these are banners. And you can make them any size you want, as long as it fits your website. So if you wanna make them square, if you wanna make them tall and thin, you could also create banners and run them on top of your header. You could run them in your actual blog post and you could create a banner just pretty much for anything. This is um, promoting my mastering Pinterest course. Um, this one is promoting my email list. Um, this is an affiliate marketing program that I'm enrolled in that I promote. So you could pretty much promote anything and everything you want. This promotes my free Etsy resource library where you could get free downloads and stuff like that. So as you can see, you could do this for your own Etsy, stop, uh, Etsy store if you have a blog for it. And you could promote um, sections of your store. You could promote just your regular store. Um, you could do banners for, you know, um, Black Friday's coming soon, Cyber Monday, Christmas sales, etc. So I thought this would be a great video um, before the busy season hits. So the first thing you have to do is, is decide what size do I want it to be. If you want to make like a little square, I would say 250 by 250. If you want to make a long one, I would say anywhere from 400 to 1400. So let's do a long one to kind of show you. And I'm going to put here um, the width 400 and the height 1400 because I want to make it long. Create. And here is my banner. And all you have to do is you can select any of these here and use these if you want. And all you will have to do is change the photo. Um, you could just upload the photo here if you have one. Um, these are some of my products. So I'm gonna put, let's see, which one can I use that will go well with this? So I'm gonna put this one here. So I'm gonna drag this and put it here. And then I'm gonna make it a little bit smaller so it could fit the actual image. Let's see if it if I'm able to. Let's see how it looks. It doesn't look too bad. I Make sure that whatever image you put here, it does fit correctly. Um, let's see if I have a different image I could use. Let's try this one. Let's delete that one. Let's drag this one here. Let's make it a little bigger. I kind of like this one for some reason. Position back and maybe bring it down a little bit so it doesn't get cut off my product. Okay, I think that looks good. So this kind of gives you an idea of what you could do. So you will put your image up here. 
you could say um, Cyber Monday or Black Friday special and all you would do is just change the text special right and then you could say you could oops so let's fix this okay you sometimes you have to kind of play with it for some reason it it keeps fluctuating so let me make it a little bit smaller there you go so I'm gonna make this the text a little bit smaller okay I think that fit a little bit better even though I kind of want it to be let's see then make this a little bigger here and you do have to play with it so just keep that in mind that looks good this I feel like could be a little bit bigger let's play with 60 and see uh, let's do 65 you want to make it easy for people to read that like when people are reading it you don't want this to be too small that they don't even take notice of it you could change the background if you need to so if you click here you're able to change the color so this is for the yellow which is the the lettering um you can make it white if you want oh, i'm sorry it's for the banner down here and then if you want the letters is right here so you could change it to black you could change it to your branding colors um, depending on the colors that you currently have uh, try to make it something that is going to stand out um, i do like the yellow because it does make it stand out however if it clashes with your website colors or your branding colors then i would say just tweak it to that color um, and then you could say something like um and Hurry special. Hurry specials and soon. And then you can make this a little bit smaller. And you could kind of click on there you go. So this is how you do it. And basically all you would need to do is download this to your computer. And when you add it as an image, it's gonna ask you. In your blog it's going to ask you if you want to link it to any particular website so when you add it as an image to your website you will link it with the url of your Etsy shop or you could link it to a section of your Etsy shop whatever you're promoting but it's pretty simple and you could come in here and you could kind of play with the different templates that they give you um, and you could tweak any of these you could take this one if you wanted to and there you go and then all you have to do is just change the wording um change here you like this one it has a coupon offer you could do that as well you could say you know you could save up to 50 percent on black friday if you use this coupon and you could change all of this like all of these colors you could change you could change the background you could change the font color you could change the actual font also if you want but as you can see, it's very simple to create these. This is a Black Friday one. I like this one because it does stand out. And you can always tweak it to your colors as well. But there's a lot of them. And this is an easy way to create banners that you could start promoting um, your products on your blog. And then when people click on it, it goes directly to your Etsy shop. You don't have to pay for someone to create these because you can make them on Canva for free. If you have a logo, I highly recommend uploading your logo right here. So you will upload it and then you're able to drag it and put it. I will put it like on the bottom somewhere or on the top, never in the middle. I think on the bottom and the top are the best spot, spots to add it. But as you can see, it's very simple to do. It will take you a few minutes to do. And then what you could do is save this file for future reference. So you could save the file and later on when you want to create different promotions, or maybe you have new listings that you want to promote, you could just tweak it to that particular promotion instead of having to restart and create a whole new banner. So I hope this video was helpful. Uh, let me know in the comment section if you guys have any questions about it. And thank you guys for watching.